Okay, so this one is, we're trying to write this as a single log rather than expand. Um, so let's start by writing log. And there's a minus sign there, so I know I'm going to have, this is going to be in my numerator, and this piece is going to be my denominator. So I'll get a division bar there. Sounds dumb, um, but a lot of times what I'll see people do, at least on paper, is write log over log. Um, so it's not that single log right there. So don't do that. Um, right here, this one half belongs to the 9x to the 6. So let's put that up in our numerator. And then we'll raise that to the 1 half. And then since this is a minus, then that means that whatever's here came from the denominator. So 1 half is the, um, I'm actually going to get rid of that now. 1 half is the same thing as a square root. So let's think of this as log square root 9x to the 6th over x squared. So then from there, we would have log. And square root of 9, that would come out as a 3. Square root of x to the 6 would be x cubed. And you could also see that back here. You didn't have to rewrite it with a radical, but just showing that these are the same thing. You could also do this being square root 9, 3, and then half of 6, x cubed. Um, so the same thing, two different notations. And then that's over this x squared. Um, but then lastly, I have 3x's up and 2x's down. So if I canceled out two of them, that should end up landing on 3x. And that would be your most simplified form of where you would take that.